What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Spiritual Jay, coming back at you again with another video. Um, <clears throat> I hope everybody's doing well. Y'all staying safe out here. But, you know, I got a little message <clears throat> for for y'all. I got a little message for whoever come across it and stuff. But don't miss your blessing. You know, don't miss your blessing. I don't know uh, who I'm talking to. I don't know who needs to hear this. Um, you know, whoever needs to hear it, just listen up. Don't miss your blessing. Now, I know I know a lot of people, you know, they they get they get real like stressed out in, in life. They get real like, you know, angry in life. But what we all need to understand is that uh and you know this devil oh let me just tell you this this devil gonna he's definitely gonna gonna try and, and attack you he's definitely gonna try and attack you because the devil knows he knows what god has for you he knows the plans of your life he knows all of that but don't let fear take over your life you know don't miss your blessing i don't know i think you know some people you know people see that you know their blessing could be right there in their face could be the opportunity could be right there and stuff but out of fear they don't go for it you know out of and sometimes it's just not even being fear you know it could be pride you know and you know god hates pride the father hates the pride, but, um, you know, and I feel like a lot of, a lot of us miss out on blessings in life because of disobedience and, um, you know, some people just don't see the, the blessings. Some people just don't see what's in front of them. Some people just don't see it. They, they paying attention to all these, these other people out in this world, <clears throat> all this fancy stuff. Uh, these nice cars, these big houses and stuff. Um, that's that's all good and all, but what we need to understand is that what God has for you is for you. A lot of those people who have that stuff rent it or not even theirs for real. Um, and you know, the past, man. The the past. I can understand that so many people probably seen that seen their past. And it was like they probably seen the blessings, the opportunities in the past, and they didn't take them because they were so blinded by sin, or, or it was just the fact that they was just, you know, just had pride and ego. And it was just like they ain't gonna do it because they wanted to focus on other things rather than you know the opportunity that was in front of them. That was more focused on other stuff. Um, don't miss your blessing though. This is not gonna be a long video. It might be like ten minutes or something, and. Um, blessings can come in any type of way. Let's say it like that. Blessings can be in any type of way. Blessings can be... See, when, when people hear a blessing, first thing that comes to mind is what? Money. That's the first thing that comes to mind to somebody is money. Money is not the only blessing. It could be a, a husband. It could be a wife. Children. New car, new house, new job. You know? It could be anything. You know? But don't just put your focus on it being money, though. That's what a lot of people got a problem with. They focus on it being money. They just want money. Money this, money that. I, I understand, you know, we live in a life where money is, is really needed in this life. But um, don't just put your focus on it. Y'all can tell you one thing about me, man. I... I know I missed a lot of blessings in my life. Take me for for a prime example. I missed a lot of blessings in my life, y'all. Doing stuff in the past that I ain't uh I ain't had no no business doing. Um you know, could have went another another route or something, you know, but instead I wanted to go and smoke weed and stuff. Um you know, so I feel like I missed a lot of the blessings in my life, man. So that's why I'm I'm on here saying this video. 
and just to encourage somebody, you know, don't don't miss your blessings. You know, don't be don't don't be that one where you going where you gonna have to look back on your life and be like, I should have done this, I should have did this, I should have took that, I should have went there, I should have did this. Don't be like that. Do it now. Do it now. Then you can. Then when you get older, the Lord's will. If you get older, you can look back on your life and be like, "Hey, at least I did it. You know, at least I, it, at least I, you know, I tried it. At least I, you know, made that phone call. At least I reached out. At least I, you know, did all of that. You know. So don't be them type of ones. You know. I know we. This life is not forever. This life is only temporary. It is. You know. But see, the way that I look at it is, yeah, you know, it's only temporary, but, you know, you, you do still want to, you know, do something in life. But don't miss your blessings, you know. Um, don't miss your blessings. I know a lot of y'all hear from God better than, than other people do. Um, whatever he's telling you to do, do it. Whatever he's telling you to, to leave alone, Leave alone. Whatever he's telling you to... Whoever whoever he's telling you to, to break up with and stop going back to them, uh, get away from him. And if you don't, then don't don't uh, cry to him about, about a heartbreak. Don't come, come cry to him about a heartbreak because you're being disobedient. So, y'all, I just want to make that video. Um, I just wanted to say, all, say that uh, just to encourage somebody, if you come across this, don't miss your blessing. Don't miss your blessing. Don't go back to that old lifestyle. Don't go back to that old lover, that old whatever, that toxic stuff. Move forward. 